this is going to be the first video, well, one of the videos in the series I'm going to do on small businesses in Cha'an. Uh, of course, many of you will recognize this place. This is Aroy Restaurant. A really cute place, a really pretty place, and uh, easily accessible. Many people know where it is. Full of antiques and uh, even have uh, a wine selection. Whites and reds. Uh, a lot of antique clocks. A lot of you have seen this uh, place before in, in some of my videos. But, uh, this is gonna be uh, part of the series on small businesses in Cha'an. As you can see, it fits a lot of people. This place is extremely popular with tourists, especially local tourism. Uh, have really good staff here. At the back here, we have Elle, who is the mainstay of this whole restaurant. Say hello, Elle. So what, <laughs> And uh, some new staff here, who I don't know. Couldn't you arrive? Hello? New. New. So I did cow. So yeah, um, it's situated on Chao Lai Road, Tanum Chao Lai, and uh, it's a really nice restaurant, as you can see. Very, very pretty. It's the situation here. Plenty of parking in the street, and a really good restaurant. I'll go and show you the menu and later I'll show you what we're about to eat. As you know, I never video people eating, so I won't be doing any video of us eating and munching, going, ah, yummy. I'll just show you the food that we get, okay? I'm just having a simple meal today, brunch, lunch. Okay. So I'll show you the video, I'll, I'll show you the, um, I'm limping of course because I've uh, had a fall down the stairs the other day. So here's the uh, menu in this place. American breakfast, steaks, I'm having a pork steak, uh, I'm having a chicken steak today. So a varied menu has uh, Western foods, Thai foods, salads, smoothies, a good restaurant. I recommend this place, especially if you're traveling with Thai people and you don't, you're not into eating Thai food all the time. There's my uh, pineapple smoothie. Yeah, so I recommend this place if you're traveling with Thai people and you're not so into Thai food or hot spicy food, you can get both kinds of food here. Great restaurant. It's the first one we're doing in the series. Okay, this is uh, the Thai meal that Luk Chan is having today. Uh, what is that called? Kao Puk Kapi. Kao? Kao. Puk Kapi. Yes. Kao Puk Kapi. Which translates into English. Mm. <laughs> and uh, this soup here, I'm not sure what it is. But that's her meal today. And uh, I'll be getting mine shortly. I'm having a chicken. So this is another little restaurant that we frequent. And this restaurant's a little bit out of town. This restaurant is called Monta. I'm not gonna tell you where it is actually. I'm not gonna put directions to it or anything like that. Find it yourself. <laughs> because it's a really good place. I don't want it to become really crowded. It's uh, not far from the beach. You can see the beach is just down the end of the road there. There's the sign for the restaurant. They do really good Thai food really reasonably priced we come here fairly regularly as do some of our friends and uh, you can eat outside or you can eat inside as you can see there's a few people there 
So yeah, this is uh, number two that I'm doing. I've done a Roy and I'll put a Roy and this one together. So this is called Monta and as you can see, it's really nicely situated, just out of town. It takes us, you know, five minutes to get here on the bike. So uh, this is the situation of Monta and uh, the Sofitel Hotel's just down that way. So that'll give you an idea where it is. The beach is just down there. And uh, yeah, so Monta, a really nice little restaurant. I'll video the food and give you the prices after we've eaten. So Monta, number two on the list of uh, my series of small businesses in Almost Cha. Got the video, the food, we're halfway through it. The uh, deep fried prawns are gone. This is a fish dish. Looks really nice. Veggies cooked in a really nice sauce with lots and lots of garlic, beautiful. Simple Thai food, but uh, exceptional quality. And uh, I'll let you know about the price. So this little restaurant will be number three in the first video in the series about small businesses in Cha Am. Now this lady is local. This is actually in our street. If you can see down there, we live just down the end of the street there. We come up here, get really good Thai food, really cheap, it's got a good menu, another really good small business in Cha Am, this is in Sport Village, and this lady's name is Kunchua Rai Pi, Kunchua Rai Pi, Kunchua Rai, and this is her little restaurant here. She's just opened again because she's had a new roof put in, which is insulated, so it's not hot here. There's a breeze. You can get a beer here. You can get everything here. And as I said, there's the menu up there. You can see the prices, like two bucks. Two bucks for food. I just had a fried rice with uh, chicken. And uh, yeah, so another little small business in Cha Am for the series. And uh, a really lovely little place, really close to home. This is another uh, of our small business uh, in Cha Am that we support. This is a restaurant that we come to pretty often. Discovered it just recently and uh, really nice food. The guy used to be the head chef at a uh, big Bangkok hotel. It's called D Beach Cafe and uh, they have an extensive Thai menu and Western menu. It's uh, at the north end of Cha Am and uh, have a little bit of seating outside. Uh, a little cafe type thing outside there. Here's uh, some of the menu. Inside, as you can see, this is the, uh, this is the head chef, Mr. Nopadom, Sawadika, and uh, he's got a smaller rice kitchen here. By chef, no, rice cooking by chef, no, yes. It's one of the only restaurants in Cha Am where you get your meal cooked by a yeah. chef, a real chef. Number yeah. one in Cha Am here. Yeah, beautiful food. And uh, yeah, some more seating outside in this hallway here. But it's um, a really lovely little place. It's, uh, we're sitting outside tonight and it's called D Beach, D Beach Cafe. Another Cha Arm small business that we support and that will be going into the series, small businesses in Cha Arm. I'll just do a little bit inside for you. I want to film those people while they're eating. How you doing? This is uh, Napadol. He was the uh, chef at Town in Town Hotel in Bangkok. And uh, yeah, it's a great little place. We come here quite regularly. 
and we regularly have this pork knuckle. Absolutely delicious. It cooks really good food. Yeah. So another um, small business.